Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Greetings to you in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ on this day, Wednesday of the 28th week in Ordinary Time. Our theme for today is Law Guided by Law. Are you guided by the Holy Spirit? You may want to ask yourself. Um, St. Paul gives us a list of virtues in the first reading of today that you may want to scan through. If you have practiced these virtues in the past and even to present, then you must be guided by the Holy Spirit. But most importantly, um, the virtue of love is one that ascertains that indeed we are Christians, we are Christ-like. Dear friends, this was the sin that the Pharisees and the lawyers actually committed. The laws that they tried to enforce lacked love. Profoundly, there was no love in this. This law were supposed to overburden men. But our Master, our Lord Jesus Christ, has actually come to make things better for us, to make these laws lighter for us. As it says in Matthew chapter 11, verse 28, Come to me, all you who are weary and are heavy laden, and I will give you rest. Are you in a position of authority? Do you lord it over your workers? Do you lord it over those who have been entrusted to your care? As a pastor, as a priest, are you um, a kind of priest that is so rigid with the law and do not consider the person or the persons who obey this law? Our Lord treats us with love. He loves us and lavishes this love upon us. It is our own obligation to, to do the same to our brothers and sisters. And then you would know fully, truly, that you are guided by the Holy Spirit. I pray this day that the Lord will bless His words in our hearts and always grant us the grace to live according to His precepts, and most importantly, to show love to our brothers and sisters. God bless you.